So, Don, yes. I got to tell you, we got this letter the other day from uh, Paula Tasner from Van Nuys, California. Does that ring a bell? The name Paula Tasner does, yes. Well, that's the part I'm talking about, not the California. <laughs> Van Nuys is a big place. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Um, so, dear Bonnie, I thought you might enjoy these photos I found of Don Lake. Don and I worked together about a million years ago as street entertainers at Six Flags Magic Mountain. Don, Whoa. I remember you telling me. Now, how old are you when you worked there? Uh, just out of college. Mm -hmm. um, so that's so, like 20? Yeah. Just out of, yeah, like 21, 22. All right. But boy, wait, wait. what an experience working at it. That's all right, it. Don, there you are. <laughs> <laughs> we all got to start someplace. Yeah. Oh, my. That's, that's Fluccini. Huh? Fluccini. Lucini the Clown, that That's was my name? silly name, yeah. I put that rubber nose on every morning. You did? Yes, yes, and then I ended okay, up with a mark on my nose from the spirit gum. This is the glue you use. Oh, my. You guys, one of the pictures isn't here. Darn it. You know what we used to do? Uh, I used to have a fake hand. The thing where I pointed to... All right, that's We used a... to have a fake hand. A fake hand? I used to have a fake white glove, and I'd go to shake hands with people, and then I'd pull a hand away, and they'd, they'd be holding my hand. But I... That's... For little children, that would be traumatizing. Yeah. And to older people. Older and people, they're startling, so, too. Oh. But that was the fun. After a while, you were entertaining yourself. <laughs> but, you know, in the early days of Magic Mountain, it was security was, was, was tough in those parks because they had, you know, they had kind of shady characters in that. And, and we used to go Not around... Not like and, now, where things are free and open and safe. But, but now there's more security. Number three what? No, there should be three. Yeah, but I guess they blew it up so much they blocked out something that I was going to point out. That's okay. Uh, That's all right, honey. Don't worry about it. But I used to go around. I'd have a fake Are phone. Are you still telling the story? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, so go ahead. You had a fake hand. It used to scare the children and the elderly, and you thought it was a riot. Yes, and, and so then there used to be certain groups, so to speak, that would come into the park to have a fun day. And I used to be in my clown outfit with a fake phone, and I used to go, and it, if, if these guys caused trouble... I would go up to them and say, park security up against the wall. And I'd get these guys, and they're tough-looking guys, and I'd have them all up against the wall like this. And I'm going with my fake hand, and I am frisking them. Oh! Yeah. And then I am going and with my fake phone, and I'm going, yeah, this is security. I got them up front by the park. These guys are going to stay right here. Now, these were really, really... Now, they have big-time security come in and get these guys. Used to be me, a fake hand, and a rubber nose pulling these guys to the side. There's a lot of... Oh. Look at this one. Aw, Don. Wow. Okay, that's Six Flags. 19, 1977, you were a clown wow. there. But this one kills me. You were a groove cat. She sent in this, the group shot. Wow. There's, oh, what's... my gosh. <laughs> yeah. So, all right, well, anyway, you were very cute, and I'm sure you were, like, the best clown ever, Don. Well, it was fun. The guy I worked with was a Ringling Brothers barman Bailey clown. And they, they are real, a real legitimate clown. And he used what, you, to, how, what makes you legitimate? Well, I was like a, a um, I was like a, <laughs> uh, what's it, in the army, Steve. In the army, when they have the the guys in uniform, like a new recruit. Like, yeah, but what are the other guys who hide with any kind of clothes and they're in anybody the anybody camouflage? Like a gorilla. A gorilla. I was kind of like a gorilla clown compared to to Mo, and Mo was a, a had a beautiful face which you you paint your face on an egg and you send it to France and that's copyright. Nobody else can do your face. You this paint is, it on an egg? Yes, and you send it to France. Well, that seems like the most fragile place to keep something that's going to be preserved. <laughs> yes. Is it a hollowed out egg? Well, yeah, there's oh. a whole ritual to it. And it goes to the museum in France, and nobody can do your face. <laughs> okay, I might as well tell it. We can edit this. I didn't know. I didn't know. The no, picture. thank you. You They're were filling because I was looking for the picture. I had a joke. From the pictures the lady sent, and I said, "Oh, Don looks different here." And then, of course, they blew that part of the picture out of it. I don't know. Uh, and then what we used to oh, do? Oh, mother of God! <laughs> Mo had a yellow. I would have been on my second Tipperillo. <laughs> you know, I was a clown once too, Bonnie. Holy <laughs> mother! <laughs> where, where did you work? I, you can talk out loud, Alec. Well, actually, if I, my cleavage is too much to say it, and I'll... <laughs> Alec is like... <laughs> it's never too much, Bonnie. Oh, no. Of course, Nick throws a coin in and makes a wish. Go ahead. 
Uh, actually, when I was a teenager, I was a trapeze artist, a flying trapeze artist. And, uh... <laughs> Thank you. No, the joke's over. You want it? No, come on in. So go ahead, Nick. Tell us about being a trapeze artist. And, and Thank this, you, Leigh. This is when Thank I was like 15. Much. And uh, we went on these tours. We went up to uh, Namibia, and uh, and part of the part of the show was that you know we had to be clowns as well as do the flying trapeze act. And then what? What's the story, though? I'm wondering. <laughs> I'll tell you what our story is. Uh oh, <laughs> Mo. <laughs> we did trapezing too. We did that you too. You did? Yeah, we also did that. Wow, yeah. I didn't realize yeah. and that. And sword swallower, and oh. we juggled. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Did, you, did you eat any fire? Yes, we did. Lots of fire. We eat plenty of it here. Fire and ice. <laughs> <laughs> well, this isn't even worth it now. But in the, in the morning meeting, when we got the letter from the lady and we were looking through the mail, they, we got these pictures of Don, and I said, boy, Don sure looks different here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so what do they do when they get ready? Everybody in the room laughs. They get ready for the show, and they blow it up. Like this. Yeah. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's the magic of television. Oi. There's no magic. <laughs> we used to do magic. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> did the last time did you gonna... ever uh, disappear? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Sure. <laughs> Where did Don go? You'd have to go up higher for headroom. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Right. Say presto. Presto. There you go. Wow. Haven't lost it. Haven't lost it. No, you haven't lost it. Oh my gosh, we're out of time. Is that it? I can't. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder why. <laughs> I mean, cut to pages of the calendar. I'm like that lady in Great Expectations, still in the wedding gown in the corner. Cobwebs. Don's still telling the story. Okay.